Hi, and welcome again to the Outdoor TV Classics YouTube channel. Today we're going to do something, well, a little bit different. Normally we take a look at old TV shows and some old commercials. Today I'm going to show you how cancel culture, yeah, cancel culture that you hear about all in the news today, cancel culture has affected people who fish and hunt for decades. I'm going to prove it to you, at least in my opinion. Remember the old American Sportsman TV show? with Kurt Gowdy? Who doesn't remember that? What a beautiful program, right? Well, back in the 60s when the American Sportsman first started, we've dug up three short little clips. I'm going to show you through the years, and not that many years, through the years how the American Sportsman went from a hunting and fishing program about people that enjoyed, you know, hunting and fishing to more of a, well, a spectator sport. It's got away from the guns, got away from the catching of the fish, got away from the hunting. I'm going to prove it to you. Now, this video quality is not really super good, but take a look at three different opens for the American Sportsman TV show. This first one was from the mid-1960s. See if you remember this. American Sportsman, a series dedicated to outdoorsmen everywhere. For those of you who love the heartbeat of the hunt, the jolt of the strike, the magic of the wild, join us, for this is the show for you. Wow. Do you remember that? I certainly do. It was all about fishing and hunting and people who enjoyed being connected with nature. Now watch, just a few years later, watch how it slowly started to morph, and I believe it was done um, intentionally. I really do. I think that way back then, uh, somebody at the TV network said, you know what, hunting and fishing is not that cool anymore. We don't want to kill stuff. We just want to sort of show stuff. So we need to back off a little bit. Here is the next open that was not that many years later. Check this one out. Well, I'm heading out. Don't know exactly where I'll be going, but I have a hunch the fishing is going to be great. Kurt Gowdy, the out of doors is my kind of excitement, and it'll be yours too on this year's American Sportsman. You'll see Jimmy Dean riding to the wilds of New Mexico to dart and tag a mountain lion. How about white wing hunting with Bing Crosby and Phil Harris? Light tackle fishing with Ted Williams. A sage grouse shoot with Dale Robertson and Cale Yarbrough. Rooster fishing with Artie Johnson. And looking for the big daddy of Bahamian angling, a great blue marlin with Cameron Mitchell. Your kind of excitement? Then watch for the American Sportsman on Sunday afternoons right here on ABC. Next Sunday at 4.30, 3.30 Central Time, 4 o'clock Pacific Time, right here on ABC. Now, here's what, it, as I'm looking at it, this is what I see. They're doing more fishing than hunting. More fishing than hunting. Why is that? Is it because fishing's easier? Or is it because fishing isn't so offensive to some people as hunting might be? But watch just a few years later what they did even to fishing. So hunting and guns are, you know, I mean, maybe they exist, but we don't even want to acknowledge them. Fishing, not quite as bad as firearms, but watch how the open changed in just a few years. See what I mean? Where are the guns? Where is it? It's a camera. There was a fishing pole. There we go. The 
the American Sportsman. Brought to you by the Miller Brewing Company. Brewers of Miller High Life. If you've got the time, we've got the beer. That's my belief, is that um, the outdoors, hunting and fishing primarily, have been replaced with uh, river rafting and uh, snowboarding and sports like that. And it's not the same. At least it is not to me. If, if you see the same thing, even if you see something different, let me know your thoughts below. But, you know, we hear about cancel culture all the time in the news. And I just wanted to show you that I think sportsmen, hunters, fishermen have sort of just been canceled. Thank God we've got, uh, you know, cable television and these niche networks where, you know, they focus on home repairs or gardening or, or you know, the outdoors. Go figure. But uh, I'd like to know what you think. Remember, the Outdoor TV Classics is a channel that salutes and, uh, and pays tribute to the men and women who taught us how to love nature and be connected with it, how to respect animals, how to be good conservationists. Um, it's not about, as I say, it's not about egos and how big your deer was, how many fish you caught. It's about celebrating and respecting those people who have gone before us. So thank you so much. I will, uh, I will see you next time. Bye-bye.